All right, good morning, y'all. Welcome to Peterson Farms of Nashville. Yes, I know I have a new hoodie, Kubota. Is that what you notice? Or is it the Kubota hat that's different? Uh-huh, that's not it. Well, I'm not quite sure what you see different about me today. Maybe, what, Bailey? Eye patch. What? Eye patch. Oh, maybe it's the, the new eye patch. Yeah, that's right. So stick around and I'll let you know how, what's going on with this. First, we gotta let the chickens out. All right, come on, girls. So anyway, <laughs> for those who didn't see my recent shorts, I did have a eye injury accident. Self-inflicted, obviously. Uh, working on the farm here. You know, farms can be dangerous. Bye. But anyway, I'll have another video coming up. I go to the doctor Monday. We did go to the emergency room. They checked me all out. Did a, took a CAT scan, said yes. We confirm that you do have a brain. I had a comedian for a doctor. That was cool. But uh, really, no pain. It's just the ugliness of the eye currently. So, and the reason I'm wearing the patch is because if I don't wear the patch, I see double. That's right, I see one of me like this, and then the other one, I see like this, right side by side. So, in order for me to be able to walk, I have to wear this patch. In order for me to be able to drive, I need to wear this patch. It helps because then I don't have to squint my eye all the time, which then creates a headache. But as long as I'm wearing this patch, as fashionable as it may be, and you guys may want to run out and buy one yourself, even whether you need one or not. Um, but all jokes aside, it allows me to keep my equilibrium. I said it, equilibrium and balance. So I don't fall down while I'm walking. And uh, with the patch, it allows my eye to relax and be open and me not having to squint all the time, which creates a headache, tension headache. So that's enough for that for right now. We're gonna hook up this trailer, me and Bailey, and uh, load up a lawnmower and take it to my son's house. And then on the way back, after we deliver the lawnmower, it's our old bad boy, um, we will pick up some railroad ties for the neighbor's fencing project.
I forgot my safety glasses. That's, those are a lot heavier than what I remember as a kid. But anyway, what I wanna do is sink that one further down into this mound right there. And then uh, we might end up adding another one or a half one here. N well, nothing here. Cause we wanna pull dirt over the top of this and create enough base hard enough probably a few inches up above this railroad tie so that they can if they want drive down and into the backyard that's under construction a little bit but anyway that's my theory so get this one dug down a little bit deeper level it out then figure out what level we need to bring that new fence off that corner straight this way the gate will be over this railroad tie and then we'll run four by four four by four or six by six six by six down that way string fence and then uh, we'll run another fence down that way we'll have a small gate where they can enter the backyard from the driveway to and from all right so anyway I think uh, it's coming uh, into view. All right, that's all it's gonna be today. Hope uh, you enjoyed that, got something out of it. And again, thanks for all the uh, well wishes and the concern about my eye. Honestly, there's no pain involved. It's just numbness and double vision. Double vision at an angle out of this eye when I have both eyes open. So as long as I have this eye covered, which really it looks worse than, then I don't even feel pain or nothing. And I can see just fine out of it with the left eye closed. And I can see just fine out of the other eye with the bad eye closed. But with both eyes, I couldn't even walk. I see two of me in the camera right now at different angles. So, Anyway, thanks for stopping in here at Peterson Farms in Asheville. We do these kind of things so that friends, family, and future generations can see what we did, learn from what we did way back when, either now or in the future. God bless you all till next time. What do you got to say, huh? 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 What you saying, boy? What you saying? What you saying? Say bye, folks. Say bye. Bye.